Our new sight word today is like. Let's read our DLO, learn about our new sight word like, sing some songs, and review the other sight word that we learned this week. Our daily learning objective. I'll read it first and then you'll read it with me. Today I will read and write the sight word like. Now it's your turn. Repeat after me. Today I will read and write the sight word like. Earlier this week we learned I and when I is a sight word it's always capital. Our new word today is like. We used that earlier um, the last couple days in our sentences with I because we knew this was our second sight word. So we just used them together so you're already familiar with it. Like. I'm going to read it and spell it three times with you. I'll go first and then you'll do it with me. This is how it this is how I like to do it. We spell it and then read it. L I K E like. Now it's your turn. We'll do it together three times. We'll read the letters, the whole word, and then we'll do it again. Say it with me. Ready? L I K E like. Two more times. L I K E like. Last time. L I K E E, like. We repeat it three times because studies show that when you practice saying something three times in a row, it helps you remember it better. So sometimes they say when you meet someone, you should try to say their name three times so that you remember it. And so when I meet you guys, if I don't remember your name, it's probably because I haven't seen you very often and I haven't said your names out loud. But that's why we're repeating it so that our brains can remember it. That's why a lot of the things that we do has a lot of repetition and consistency over and over and over again so we can help remember it. I'm going to put like right there. I want to review the song for I, capital I spells I and I is about me, M, E. We'll just listen to one verse of the song and then we'll learn the like song. Try and sing along. Capital I spells I and I is about me. M E. Capital I spells I and I is about me. M E. Capital I is a letter and a word that's about me. Capital I spells I and I is about me. M E. We'll pause there. I'm not a good singer, but I still try, so that's what I hope you can do at home. Let's listen to our like song. We'll listen to the whole thing. I won't sing it. You won't have to listen to me sing. I promise. Not today. Tomorrow. I will. Listen to the song and then when you're writing like you can hum the tune or if you can't remember what letter comes next you go um, oh yeah. <laughs> All right. Here's the next one. Here it is. The song goes L-I-K-E spells like. L-I-K-E spells like Hi ho, did you know L I K E spells like? Uh oh, come on, boo box. Well, let's see. Here we go. L I K E spells like. L I K E spells like. Hi ho, did you know L I K E spells like? I like the color blue, I like my new shoes too. Hi-ho, did you know L-I-K-E spells like? L-I-K-E spells like, L-I-K-E spells like. Hi-ho, did you know L-I-K-E spells like? I like to fly on planes, I like to ride on trains. Hi-ho, did you know L-I-K-E spells like? L-I-K-E spells like. I'll put like right here. We're going to practice writing it. I'll show you how to write it. You will have a chance to write it in your journeys. Notebook today on page 10. And I would do the journeys page first so that you could practice writing it here with a pencil. And then we'll do our sight word page. All right, here we go. 
what light color do I want to use? Mm, use blue again. Blue's a good one. When I write like, L is tall, it touches the sky and the ground. I is short, oops, sorry, the glare. K is tall, E is short. We haven't learned all these letters yet, that's okay, but that's why we're practicing now. Like, L starts at the sky and it's a straight line down. It looks like the number one. L, I, I is short, so I'm going to start at the fence, go to the ground, jump up, add a dot. The one thing I don't want to see are lollipops. That is not the letter I. A lollipop is a sucker, it's a treat. It is not a letter. So mom and dad, whoever's helping you do this, no lollipops. I is short. Start at the fence. Down. Dot. K is tall. K is down. Now I have to jump sideways to the fence. Kick in. Kick out. Start at the fence. So the second part is short. Kick in. Kick out. Touch the ground. E. E starts right in the middle. I'm going to go over. Up. And around like. Let's spell it. L I K E. Like. I'm going to write it two more times because you are going to write it twice or three times in your journeys book, and then you'll have to write it three times here. So we'll practice two more times. We'll go a little quicker for you. Move my little guy over. Like. I'm going to leave the finger space here. Like. L I K E. In, kick out. E. Up and around. Like. One more time. Last time. Finger space. L. I. K. Kick in, kick out. E. Like. In your journeys book, on page 10, there's two different directions down here. Don't do the second part. It's not necessary. When you see their name up here, don't forget, everybody, write your name. If you can't write your name yet, have mom or dad get that magic highlighter, write it, and you will trace over it. With the pencil, it means it's time for you to write. I want you to read the word like and spell it. L-I-K-E. Like. It says, number one, I blank strawberries. You're going to write like right here. I like strawberries. Then you'll read the sentence to whoever's helping you. Even though there's no words for strawberries, a picture, just like in our PASI lessons, the picture is still a, represents a word. I like strawberries. You'll write like four times. If you need help, the marker will help you. I like bananas. I like grapes. I like fruit salad. Don't forget to read the sentences so that you're practicing reading our new word. When you're done with that, you will get your sight word packet and tear like off. I hope I have my scissors. I think I put them somewhere else, so I'll grab them in just a minute. I'm going to use the highlighter on this so you can see it, but you at home will use your pencil. At the top, it says name. You need to write your name. Mrs. Hawkins, that is who I am. Mrs. Hawkins. I wrote my name at the top. It says, write the word. How many times are you going to write it? Let's see. One, two, three times. I'm going to scoot this up a little closer so you can see it. And I can show it to you better. Like. L I K E. Like. Again. L I K E. Like. Last time. L I K E. Like. 
when you're writing it, spell it out. It will help you learn these other letters we haven't learned yet, and it will help you remember the word. Color the word. This is where you get to color. Not all of our worksheets have a coloring spot, so um, get a crayon or marker, whichever you want. Don't do a pencil. That's not fun. We don't color with pencils. We write with pencils. We illustrate with markers and crayons. Or a color pencil if you have one of those too. Go ahead, color it in. Say the letters though when you do it. Don't just color time. We're still learning. L-I-K-E. L-I-K-E. <laughs> Excuse me. Maybe I'll use my purple marker because purple is my favorite. Excuse me. Do it one more time. L I K E. Like. Circle the word just like we did on the other worksheets. You need to find like. Circle it. It's jumbled in here. When you find it, give it a circle with a pencil. I'm using a highlighter just so you can see it from the computer. When you're done, it says cut and paste the word, just like the other day. And I don't know where my scissors went. Let me grab some. I have my scissors. I put them away. If I don't put things away, I lose them. And I had put them on my desk. Just like the other day, cut across. If you just cut out each individual one, it makes a mess, it's sloppy. You just need to take both hands, carefully cut all the way across. Now I have all the letters. They're not mixed up this time. Just all four letters, we need all of them. What I'm going to do is just cut down. Then I'll cut across again, because I've cut a lot of things. So I know some good short cuts. Ha -ha fix this to get it done quicker. Can you see? Maybe my hand's in the way. Whoops. Don't forget to throw your trash in the bin. I'm going to just trim it. And today's, you won't have a sentence to write here. That's okay because tomorrow when you write in your writing journal, you will have the chance to write like in a sentence. Like I said, this worksheet is just a little bit different than the other one that I normally have. And that's okay. I have all my letters cut out. I just need to glue them on. Get your glue stick. Make sure when you get the lid off, you just push it up just a little bit. Do not unscrew it or screw it up all the way because it'll fall out and then you'll cry and no one wants to see you cry over a glue stick. So just, just a little bit. The first letter I need for like is L. Take my L, give it a smudge, nice good smear, and put L on there. And give it a little squish. What's the next letter? I. Give it a smudge, take it off, glue it on. Does that look right? No, I glued it upside down. You can't glue the letters upside down because then it's not correct and it'll just look crazy. So if you have one upside down or sideways, you just peel it off and put it on the correct way. And if you're not sure, look up at the top. It'll show you. Our next letter, K. Give it a smudge. Glue it on. Last letter, E. Smudge, glue it on. Very good. The very last thing you need to do is trace it with your pencil. I'll use my marker so you can see. It says trace the word, spell it out loud. L I K E. Nice job. Now it's your turn.